Hey everybody, um, I want to do a quick demo on Tiny here. He is a, oh what are you, five year old probably Pomeranian and he was actually one of my rescue dogs that I adopted to a client and our agreement was that she never ever 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 have him shaved down. So Tiny is in full coat, he always has been, he, ever co he comes every four weeks and he's always super thick. I just wetted him down really quick to show you how look at the undercoat but with tiny i don't with the yuppie puppy bath brush i swear you do not have to go in and pre-rake pre-do anything you can't get a comb through this anyway never so i wetted him down real quick I'm using true groom shampoo today i really it's new to me and i really really truly love it i love it um turned on to me by my great friend and expert michelle knowles um, so I wet him down real quick with the research. Grab me a yuppie puppy bath brush. Give it a quick rinse. Sitting here in bleach water all day. That's how I do it. And I swap between them. And I'm going to put just a little, little bit on Tiny and just start brushing. Get through his coat, kind of at least one time scrub his feet scrub his grubby feet it's been kind of rainy here everybody's super muddy i may even do a quick one on my own little shih tzu willow here in a little bit because her feet if you can see willow come here show everybody your feet yeah you've been in my flower garden this morning so anyway okay I'll keep on going. So another little tiny drop. I'm gonna scrub his little feet. Get up under his arm. Yeah. Oh, oh. See, I don't need to be noosed. I'm a good boy. So yeah, he's so thick everywhere. Oh my goodness. But every four weeks, I get every little bit of hair out of him. Because this brush loosens it up. And sometimes he's even a little bit scaly, just probably because, you know, it's the way they get. And this brush loosens it up, and I can scrub it right out with this, with some water flow. Get up and all oh, your nooks and crannies. See your butt. Can we see your butt? Beep. Got a little pooper right there. Comes right off. His tail. Is that up in here? You can't get a comb through that. But we aren't gonna need to. You'll see. Okay. One more time. Up under your bed. So this is just it's oh sorry it's not only loosening it up it's getting right down to the skin are you tired are you tired it was a long weekend for everybody wasn't it so that's my initial scrubbing and then to loosen this stuff up really good check this out take your brush get the water flow going look at that that has how you get the scales and crap up out of there. You brush softly brushing. And you are gonna see when I blow him out, oh, stuff's gonna glide right on out of there. Oh boy. Turn around. Hey, turn around, please. So Got all of his hair going in the same way. His coat going in the same direction now too. All right. Pausing. Give him a quick rinse. The shampoo is distributed. I can see little shiny, you know, bubbles in there, but it literally takes just a minute or less. You thoroughly rinse him out. So mobiles, man, does it save you on water. And everybody else, too, product. 
a little tiny bit of product goes a long way with a yuppie puppy back brush. Okay, so, got that done. And now I'm gonna head in with a little tool. I'm gonna rinse this out in a second. And I'm gonna give it with some true groom conditioner. All over, straight on, because this stuff is awesome. It seems to be like making them not as thick, too, because that is why I needed something new to try. I think the shampoos I was using, and they're awesome, I love them, but maybe in some instances you need to change up what you're doing. And this mixed with some avocado oil is uh has seriously helped some of my really 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 thick furries so got that now i want to get it all the way down to the skin yes and that feels good through his hair through his feet all over right it will push it right down through those big, this big thick butt and its tail and I can feel it distributed now it all just feels like butter okay I'm gonna give him a quick rinse and I will pause real quick and try to get some blow drying going so you can see what I'm talking about Yum. Look at it. Feels like rabbit fur now. Okay, I'm not going to bore you with this. I'll be back in a moment. Okay, I am back. Um, I'm going to give him a quick blow dry. See how it just gets right down to the skin.
Well, most dogs don't love having a big old comb or brush going through them when they're so thick. So I'm just saying, I'm not telling you how to do it, but this is an alternative for you. I'll pause again until we're done. So, as you can see, Tiny is about dry. All we have left to do is just a little bit around his head. So I wanted to show you how flowy he is. Okay, watch me. Come here, boo. Tiny. Look. Look. Come here. <laughs> Come on. Okay. All right, I'm going to turn him around.